right now. Pittsburgh's best sports show is about to begin. Call us or tweet us. We've got things to talk about on the Ireland Contracting Nightly Sports Call. Good evening, everyone. Welcome inside the Fan Cave. This is the Ireland Contracting Nightly Sports Call. We do it every single night of the week, seven nights a week. We invite you to join the conversation by calling the Bordis and Bordis Hotline, which is 412-575-2600. And today, we saw T.J. Watt on the field once again. Bob Pompiani joined by Andrew Filipponi tonight up at 93.7 The Fan. And Andrew, T.J. Watt practiced two days in a row. Uh, and I know that's you know, a little bit of a tease potentially for if maybe he can be in the lineup this Sunday. I don't expect him to be, but would you rule that out completely knowing him? Well, they need it. They need something like that. You hear these guys on the offensive side of the ball talk. They're in dire need of a morale boost. Something's got to happen here that gives this team a little bit of pep. And you know, TJ Watt saying, I'm going to try to give it a go. And even if I'm not at 100%, just pitch count me, and I'll be there for my team against the last undefeated team in the NFL, I think that could do wonders for this, the psychology of this Steelers team, their mental state going into this game. So I'd like to think, Bob, let me ask you this question. If it were a playoff game on Sunday, do you think T.J. Watt would play? Absolutely. I mean, he's, Well, then I think he needs to treat this game like it. He yeah. should. There's the a bye only, week the after that. Is, right. They need, to, they need to win desperately. If they have fancy themselves as a playoff team, they got to win this game. They, gotta get to, they can't go to two and six. The numbers just don't indicate teams historically come back from that sort of deficit. So, yeah, if, if they want to look at that, now there's a danger, of course, bringing him back a little too soon, but it's up to the doctors and him and them to figure it all out. So, I wouldn't rule it out completely. I don't know if I expect it. Would you expect it? No. I'm not expecting it, but I do think it's an. I think it's on the table because he's going to talk tomorrow. Mm -hmm. He's going to talk, which to me, if he's not ready, Calvin Austin hasn't talked. He was on IR. The Casey guy hasn't talked. The fact that he's on injured reserve and the Steelers are actually giving him the uh, the ability to do it too. I mean, they could easily say no, TJ. You're not on the active roster. You're not going to say anything. Uh, I, I think they're starting to be a little bit of. Uh, clues here, putting them together that, that might suggest he's at least trying to talk them into mm -hmm. letting them play Sunday against the Eagles.